Hey, I'm Brian, Slasher and Suits. What's going on, dudes? And today, we finally got a trailer for the new Scream. Not Scream 5, but Scream, the sequel to Scream. And here's the kill count of the trailer. Would you like to play a game, Tara? I hear people are thinking this is the opening kill and it makes sense. You're like, whoa, a landline? What year is this? But it's actually, oh, yeah, uh, you know, I'm probably at my grandma's house. She still pays for her landline. Or look it up, like, who uses that? But we did get a nice, gruesome leg snap. Like, oh, man, stomped the back of her leg and broke it how Conor McGregor did in his last fight. We also see a very cool return. That's a very cool shot of Stu's old house. But look at that. We also got a glimpse of Ghostface inside the hospital chasing a handicapped person. Or at least a girl in a wheelchair with a boot on. A boot that he just stomped and broke on. So for some reason he couldn't finish the job at this point. He's like alright I'm going to break her leg and I'll meet her Halloween 2 style back at the hospital to finish the job. You ready for this? Never. Kill number two is interesting because look, he's a lettered in something and Ghostface seems to be a bit away from him so he was able to catch up with him unless like Ghostface put that fool like in a bear trap or something. Something's wrong with this guy's leg that Ghostface could just come up and stab him. Or Ghostface is like an athlete himself, man. That's why I was like, you need to be a bit athletic to pull off the Ghostface to be a killer. I won't sleep until he's in the ground. Damn, look at that. Someone straight up gets set on fire. That's everywhere. Like, that could be a ghost face in a row, but I think I'll just count that as a kill. But, dude, if you notice, that was the kitchen. That's still Stu's kitchen. I mean, uh, maybe no one's remodeled that since the 90s uh, anyway, but that's the same tile. Maybe after Stu's parents died, uh, whoever inherited the house, that's who's burning. There's certain rules to surviving. The attacks were all on people related to the original killers. So, the new plot is the killer's going after relatives of Billy and Stu, but I already made a video about that, them being gay, but definitely Stu wasn't as gay as Billy, because Stu was a cocksmith. He was also getting that and laying pipe to Rose McGowan, and he also laid pipe on Drew Barrymore, so he could have some illegitimate children, who knows. Something about this one just feels different. All right, that car guy right there doesn't seem like it's a death. Like, he seems like, oh, that could be like Jigsaw, how he just sort of kidnaps you. But then later on, you see a little bit of a clip of someone actually getting stabbed. So you see the knife there and then penetrating him. But yeah, I think probably something cooler's got to happen to him, man. We need more better kills than just stabbings. Hopefully he does something with the car, like run him over or something. But I will count that guy as being dead. There's a couple of stabbing victims too. I won't count them as being killed, but I'll count them as being stabbed. This girl's stabbed pretty much in the stomach on Stu's porch. And I'm like, oh, he's not only trying to kill high school students. That's like a college girl, a 30-year-old. You don't get sleeves like that overnight. That takes a lot of time and sessions. And that was like, oh, those are tattooed sleeves. Those are just regular sleeves. Yeah, I guess she could be in high school. And stabbing victim number two. See, it's a mixed girl. Uh, you know, that could be Billy Stu's kid. No, unless it was like a mixed relationship kid. I don't know. Well, see, there's blood on the knife and blood on her shirt. So she did get stabbed, but she's fighting it. She ain't trying to get finished off. So all these victims are going to be related to Stu and Billy in some way. So if you find a clue that links them and eliminate who's not being killed and who's alive, you'll find out who the killer is. 
So I got a total kill count of four for this trailer. Four who are definitely going to die. Then I got two more possible stab victims who might die. Maybe in the next trailer or something like that we can see more of this. But I hope people aren't just getting stabbed. I need something like Tatum getting like brought up and chopped in half in the garage door see look he's using other stuff too like now he can use apps for like door unlocks and everything so that makes sense like do some new cool stuff all right so if you like that subscribe uh like follow me on patreon instagram twitter all those things and catch you dudes later later dudes hello it's happening three attacks so far do you have a gun I'm Sydney Prescott, of course I have a gun.